What's going on guys? I'm Adelid and welcome back to Hellblade. The last time we left off, we're pretty much looking, going through these shards to get the Sword of Garm. I think it's called Garm. I might be getting my names mixed up and if I do, I apologize. I'm really bad with names. And I think we have like one... Oh, I've already been there. I think we have like one more area we have to go to. Like there, there, there's certain trials you have to go to in order to get back through it. And then I think we go back and then we go to some of these other areas. But I think it's this one. And some of them are easy, some of them are kind of cool, but there was one that was hard. And so hopefully we're not running into another hard one. Northmen say that their all father, Odin, gave his eye in exchange for a drink from Mimir's well, the well of wisdom. Is that all you had to say? In blindness. There can be wisdom. Only by giving can you receive in return. Mm. For this reason, I give my life and pass on my stories of the Northmen to you, Senua. Ooh, are you cold? Oh, it is really dark in here. Sounds like Dillion. I'm right here. Can't you see me? Oh. It's dark as fuck. Help me. Breathe slow. It's the darkness. Stay still. Empty your thoughts. Oh. Is it can actually see in front of me? Tell me what you feel. The breeze. Good. Then there is a way out. I can't tell where it comes from. Yes, you can. Oh. Oh. That is cool. I'm using my focus to pretty much help me figure out where to go. This is just neat. And also, if you hear the sound, too, if you're looking around, like, you look anywhere else, right, you don't f hear the breeze. But if you're looking at it or close to it, you can hear it. God, that is cool. The others. The voices. They've gone. I'm still here. It's so quiet. Maybe I should just it's stay so here dark. so they it's don't okay. so they can shut up. Listen to your own breath. Where is this place? Feel it rise and fall. Good. Be aware of everything you hear and feel. Let your senses guide you. There's a... It's kind of really cool because there's like... You could see around you a little bit. I mean, it leads you right to where you need to go, but... It, it's also very creepy because you can hear the chains. What well, sounds like fire. I can't go on. Lillian? Find a way. I'm not leaving you here. So there's a way around, another way. Oh, well, there's fire. Oh, I'm like actually blind in this one. The fire is helping me lead the way too. Like, listen to the chimes and just fall in your way. It's kind of a really neat way of playing this game. Where is this place, though? Oh, that's where I was at just a second ago. Now there's running water right here. I think I'm somewhere else now. But the breeze has gone. Use all of your senses. Let the world speak to you. Become Daredevil. What do you hear? I hear water. Go to it. Definitely do not go to that frickin' crow. I'm just saying. Because I don't trust Val Raven. Now see the sound of water. Okay, yeah. 
It's the same thing as the wind, you know, the breeze. You just listen for... You can either focus and see it, it just pops up. Or if you get close to it, you can hear it. I've reached the water. Good. That's your way out. Follow it upstream. I least I can understand that. I'm so sorry. I thought I left this all behind. Don't be sorry. It's not your fault. He was right. It's inside of him. It won't let me go. Senor, my father, he taught me that the hardest battles are fought in the mind, not the soul. You are no coward. He proved that to me in the warrior trial. You are not a coward, this that's for sure. Another battle. You can beat him. This isn't so bad. You don't have to help me. I want to. You are going to be a great warrior one day. We need people like you. Okay. I'll do my best. Why do I have a feeling this is going to get really dark really fast? A lot of dead bodies. And so she's forced to relive it. To what end? What is this? Oh, I'm going to a cave. Man, but Dillian seems like a pretty good guy. He seems like he just. He's willing to do anything for this this chick. But then again, this is also in her head. So it just might be how she's voicing who what Dillian who he was or how she per perceives Dillian. You know? What the hell is this? <clears throat> I feel like this is more Val Raven's tricks. I can't go on this way. Then Wait. look for another way and tell me what you find. <gasps> there is a house. What kind of vision is this supposed to be? Where, I mean, like, where? Because all these other places were at certain locations. I don't know what's inside. <clears throat> don't be afraid. Oh, you tumbled pretty bad. Oh. There's something in here. Do you see it? No. Then it cannot see you. Quietly move past it. One step. Okay, so there it is. What is that? I'm kind of doing exactly what he says, one step at a time. Oh, there's chains though. Oh no. I, I don't want to touch the chains. Oh, maybe I can go around them. Oh, I don't want to touch these chains. Ah, ah. What the fuck is that? Oh, I don't even know where to go. But that thing looks... Oh. I have to go around? I have to literally go around it. One step. One step. One step. Oh, jeez. That I, I'm glad I, could, I can't see it. There's a door over there. Oh, and there's more chains. There's pots. Yes, I'm, I'm doing it, Dillian. I'm going around. But I need to avoid those chains. I'm giving this guy like the widest berth I possibly can because I'm pretty sure if I go near him, 
And he's just going to eat me up. Uh. Okay, I don't. I was nervous because I was hearing that like a thing. Oh, there's more chains. Shoot. I don't know if I can get away with this time. This time. Uh. What the hell are you supposed to be? He's like truly like if there's something like this was all hell like everything is like very Norse based you know Viking stuff like that that you would figure like their hell would be but that is actually something very like I'd, I'd imagine what hell would be you know? Very chaotic everywhere, monstrous. It's not following me. Good. Oh, there's a there's a bell, like a chime. Oh, but there's another one. There's a couple of them. And these ones are moving. Ah, oh, jeez, how am I to do this? Okay, it looks like they moved past. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, it's not a chime, it's just stuff. Okay, I need to move past these guys. I just gotta do it. Okay. It looks like there's another one over here. But it looks like there's him. So I gotta be careful again. Okay. Where's your path? As long as none of you walk into me. I think I'm good. You're staying quite stationary. You're staying over there. Or you're not staying over there. You're moving. Okay, now you're turning back. Jesus. This is crazy. Okay. Made it past that one, but now there's that one. Oh, there's two of them. I have to get to that gate. Is my best bet when they're all separated like that? I'm not sure. Oh, it's so dark. It's so dark. Did I make it? Oh, please say I did, because I want to get away from those things. They were, oh, that's what they reminded me of. They remind me of the Chaos and Warhammer. Oh, save. It stinks. Of death. The darkness is testing you. You are in control. Alright, seems like there's one more of these I have to dodge. Are you serious? I'm going to have to walk across this? In the door? Oh, come on, man. Oh, no, no, no. No, 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 no. Oh, that messes you up so bad. I just got to go slow. When you start losing your bat oh my gosh, this is so disorienting. Because it starts swaying. Like if you move too much. 
very disorienting. Well, as well. Don't turn back. You're getting close. I'll, I'll listen to you. We're going to go inside the well. I guess that's a wealth of knowledge. Oh fuck! There's more of these guys in here. Did you help me? Oh, this is not a good spot. Come to the oh, this is not a good spot at all. Um. Ah, crap. That was close. There's a lot of dead bodies here. Okay, I'm going. Oh, no, no, no. No, no, no. Get away from me. I don't want anything. I don't want no cookies. No cookies, please. creepy. This has like been the most creepiest episode part of this game. Is that her? I doubt that. That can't be her darkness manifesting. In that, oh. oh, I think that's just a rock. Can I run up there now? Because I, I don't think her darkness would be like that. Just a bunch of like chaotic m disformed beasts, you know? You know, like, I'm saying, like, the monster within, you know, kind of thing. I think I can actually run now. I don't have to focus. Trust your senses. That's an achievement I just, uh, uh... She could spend hours. I just learned, unlocked. Days even. Trapped within herself. In the dark. You see me? Yes. Your eyes were open, but you were... Gone. Gone. And when it finally let her go, she could be anywhere, with no memory of how she got there. When it comes for me, I have no power over it. But here, for the first time, Someone was there to help. But I heard your voice. You brought me back. You found your own way back. All you needed was a little help. A little hope. Oh man, they almost showed his face. I actually think they showed his face last time. Oh man, now I can actually go get the sword and that mu with grammar reforged, you will have Odin's blessing to walk a goddess into the halls of Helheim and challenge Hela as an equal. So Dillian was helping me. And the sword will lead me to him. Like when we first met. So man. Her darkness is really like I just feel really bad for this chick, you know? Like I understand it's just a game, but this story is like really sad for her. Like could you imagine that just pretty much she blacks out and then she just wakes up someone different. She has no idea what she's done or anything like that. The darkness is overwhelming her. You know, and, and from what I understand, it's like she's just trapped with those beasts in complete darkness while this is happening, while she's just wandering around, you know, and then, but Dillian was there to help her, and now he's dead. I can understand why she's going on this journey for this guy. Oops. Almost passed it. 
Dillian gave her the strength to pass the warrior trials. Graham released. She saw a way out. To leave her past behind. And become a warrior. In Dillian's clan. Come on, come on, come on, come on. The soul is tainted by the gods of darkness. Leave it. No. He left it here. He wants me to take it. You will pay a price for this. Well, this is turning up for the worst. Years later, with Zinbal's parting words still haunting her, the darkness came back with a vengeance. A plague. Do you? Everyone suffered. My father was not supposed to die like this. This is your fault. No. You have brought this plague to us. You have blood on your hands. Oh, what in the holy shit is this? Coming for you now. They're coming. They're coming to get you. Oh, what the fuck. Anyways, guys, we're gonna end this episode here. It's constantly saving. I don't know why it's doing that. Oh, no, we're not. She's going to die. No, she isn't. She needs to you. Because it's coming back. Dude, I just kicked your ass. You thought I was gonna end the episode here without just. Oh, you hit me. The ship broke up under them. The ship that had sailed from the land of shining fields. Their memorial stone is sacred. Come not here in the sun. Come not with a sword. Come not crying over a naked corpse. Come not with disturbed mind. All right, guys. Like I was saying before, we're going to end this episode here. Holy crap, we're about to get into some craziness because that looks like a wall of hands. <laughs> And, but we got the, a new sword, the sword that Dillian was trying to do. But also at the very end, we noticed that there was another vision of how Dillian, probably at the end, thought that she did bring the plague upon them, which is doesn't help her cause. Anyways, so hope you all enjoyed this episode, and I'll see you all next time.